1.3a, Exponents and Order of Operations. Focusing on exponents. Exponents are merely repeated multiplication It is basically a shortened version of writing out a repeated multiplication. It is shown in the example 5 exponent 3. The 5 in this case is known as the base. The base is what gets repeated. We then have the other portion, which is called the exponent. The exponent tells us how many times meaning how many times do we repeat the base. Since the base is 5 and that is what gets repeated, we know that we are going to have 5 and the 3 or exponent shows us how many times we repeat it. It says to repeat it 3 times. Remember this is also repeated multiplication which means it is 5 times 5 times 5. In example 1, we have 2 to the 5th. In 2 to the 5th, we must once again determine what number is getting repeated and how many times it is being repeated. Remember the base is getting repeated. And the exponent is how many times. Therefore, this problem is a shortened version of 2 being multiplied out 5 times. As you can see, writing 2 to the 5th would take much less time than writing 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. It is useful to know how to expand it back out in order to solve the problem. 2 to the 5th can therefore be solved by working left to right. 2 times 2 is 4. We then bring down all pieces that we have yet to solve. Next, we have 4 times 2, which would give us 8. Once again, bringing down the pieces yet to be solved. Next, we have 8 times 2, which is 16 bringing down the last 2, which has yet to be used. Finally, we have 16 times 2, which is going to result in the number 32. Therefore, 2 to the 5th is 32. Example 2 shows 7 to the 2nd, or 7 squared. In this example, the 7 is the base, which is the number being repeated. And the 2 is the exponent, which is the number of times we repeat. Therefore, 7 is repeated 2 times. In this problem to solve, we just have to multiply 7 times 7, which results in 49. Remember that exponents are merely a shortened version of writing repeated multiplication, in which the base in this case the 7, is what gets repeated and the exponent, in this case 2, is the number of times you repeat it. After expanding out to the repeated multiplication, you are then able to multiply and get an answer.